Good day mga boss! Welcome po ulit sa ating channel, Math Tutorials TV. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to multiply any numbers using lines or by drawing lines. So this is also called the Japanese style of multiplication. So are you ready? Let us start! So yung ituturo kong technique sa inyo ngayon mga boss is pinakamadaling paraan kung paano mag-solve ng product ng dalawang numbers. So this technique originated from Japan. Kung hindi nyo po na itatanong mga boss, last week is nanggaling po ako doon sa amin sa Japan. So itong technique na ito mga boss is nakuha ko po sa bayan ng Konoha. So isishare ko lang sa inyo mga boss. Okay? So nang nandun ako mga boss sa Japan, napag-alaman ko din po na sa Japan pala mga boss, walang araw at saka walang gabi. Kasi, hapon. Okay? So, walay. Okay? So, go back tayo sa ating topic mga boss. So, eto ang yung pinakamadaling paraan, no? Kung paano kumuha ng product or mag-multiply ng any numbers. Kasi, magdodraw lang tayo ng lines. Okay. We will start to find the product of 12 and 13. So, what is the product of 12 and 13? So, yung gagawin lang natin mga boss, uulitin ko, magdodraw lang tayo ng lines to find the product of these two numbers. Okay, first, we have 12. Okay. So, na-notice nyo mga boss, yung 12, meron tayong dalawang digits. We have 1 at saka 2. Okay. So, ito yung basihan natin kung ilang lines yung idodraw natin. So, first for 12, so sa unang digit, we have 1. So, ibig sabihin, magdodraw lang tayo mga boss ng isang line. Okay, for 1. Okay, so draw tayo ng line. Okay. Next, we have 2. So, lagyan na natin ng malaking space mga boss between this line at saka sa line ng 2. Okay, so this line corresponds to the digit 1. So, 1 digit means isang line. So, sa second digit, 2. So, it means guguhit tayo ng dalawang lines. Okay, 1. Okay, so yung isa medyo malapit lang sa kanya. Okay. Okay? So, these lines correspond to the number 12. So, we have 1. So, isang line. So, we have 2. Dalawang lines. Okay? So, um, suggestion ko lang mga boss, when you draw lines, so, dapat medyo magkasing haba yung lines ninyo. Kahit hindi naman pareho yung haba ng lines nyo, basta, basta um, medyo magkapareho lang yung haba para mas um, organize yung drawing nyo. Okay? So next, we have 13. So dito naman tayo guguhit ng 13. So we have also 2 digits. We have 1 and 3. Okay? So I will use another color of pen para at least makikita nyo. So this is 1. Uh, okay? This is for 1. Next, we have 3. So guguhit lang tayo ng 3 lines. 1, uh, 2, at saka 3. Okay? So, we have 3 lines. So, these lines correspond to the number 13. We have, first digit is 1. Ito, isang line. Second digit is 3. So, we have 3 lines. Okay? So, Paano nahahanapin natin yung product ng ating dalawang numbers 12 at saka 13? So, yung bibilangin na natin mga boss is yung intersections ng lines. Okay? So, kung na-notice nyo mga boss, we have three columns here. So, this is the first or three groups. So, this is the first group. Ito yung pangalawang grupo. Okay? Align sila. Okay? Naka-align ito. At saka ito. Okay? So, bibilangin lang natin mga boss yung Um, intersection ng, mang, ng dalawang or ng mga lines. Okay. So, sa first group, okay, bilangin natin kung ilan yung intersections. So, you have 1, okay, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. By the way, mga boss, you start counting the intersections mula rito sa right papuntang left. Okay. So, we have 6. Sulat natin yung 6. So, how about in this group, ilan yung intersections? We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 
So we have 5. And here, we have 1 intersection. We have 1. So, what is 12 times 13? So, it is 156, mga boss. So, 12 times 13 is 156. So, it's a check lang natin, mga boss, if tama yung sagot natin. So, we have 12 times 13. That is 156. So, tama po yung sagot natin, mga boss. Okay, next example tayo, mga boss. We have 14 times 25. Okay? So, una, mga boss, iguguhit natin yung lines that correspond to the number 14. So, ulit, ulitin natin, we have two digits. So, una, 1. So, dito tayo guguhit ng uh, isang line kasi we have one digit here. So, we have isa. Okay. Next, sa pangalawang digit is we have 4. So, again, um, alat lang tayo ng medyo malaking space. No, to separate the first and the second digit. Yung mga lines sa first at sa second digit. So, draw lang tayo ng apat na lines. Okay, isa, dalawa, tatlo, at saka apat. Okay? So, these lines correspond to the number 14. Next, we have 25. So, guguhit lang tayo ng mga lines that correspond to number 25. So, the first digit is 2. So, dito natin i-draw yung dalawang lines. Okay? So, gagamit ako ng ibang color para mas makita nyo. Okay? So, we have here uh, 1 and we have Okay, we have two lines. Next, we have five. So, dito naman ako kukuhit ng five lines. Um, gawin na natin, uh, lagyan na natin ng space to separate the five lines sa dalawang lines. Kasi ibang digit na to yung five lines. Okay, so separate natin. Ganito ang lang mga boss. Draw lang ako five lines mga boss. So, we have here one. Oops, napasobra. We have two. We have 3, 4, and the last 5. Okay. Break na natin mga boss. Okay? So, eto na. So, this, yung orange na mga lines correspond to the number 25. So, we have 2, we have 1, 2, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yung green na mga lines, mga boss, correspond to the number 14. So, we have first digit is 1. Ito, isa. Second digit is 4. We have 4 lines. Now, uh, meron na tayong tatlong grupo na naman, mga boss. Okay, ito. Okay, ito. Oh, sorry. Ito. Okay. At saka ito. Okay. So, ito, isang grupo lang ito kasi naka-align sila. Okay. So, ikakount na natin, mga boss, yung... Uh, intersections. So, uh, always remember, we will start from the right side. Okay? So, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So, 20 tayo dito, mga boss. Okay? Kung nananotice nyo, we have two digit numbers. So, dito. So, first, yung intersection. So, yung gagawin na natin, mga boss, yung once digit lang yung itira natin. Okay? At yung uh, tens digit, yung pangalawang digit ng ating number, i-add natin mamaya sa kung ilan yung intersection ng sa second group. Okay? So, instead na 20 yung is isulat na dito, you have to write 0, and then yung 2, i-add natin sa next na group. So, you have here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 plus 2, that is 15. Now, dalawang digits na naman. So, ulit, yung once digit is ititira natin. Yung, yung tens digit is i-add na naman natin sa another group. So, we have here 1 plus. Okay? So, bilangan natin. 1, 2. So, we have 2. 1 plus 2 is 3. 3, 5, 0. In other words, 14 times 25 is 350, mga boss. Okay? We will check again sa uh, calculator kung tama yung sagot, sagot natin. We have 14 times 25. 
Okay, Karan, that is 350. Tama tayo mga boss. Okay, now, last example tayo mga boss. We will try a much uh, larger number or larger numbers mga boss. So, we have here 131 or 131 times 122. So, in this case mga boss, meron tayong tig tatatlong digits ng numbers. So, ulitin natin, magdodraw lang tayo ng lines to find the product of these two numbers. So, first, unahin natin is 131. So, sulat tayo dito. First digit is 1. So, magdodraw lang tayo ng isang line. Okay, 1. Okay. So, that's it. 1. Okay. Next is 3. Okay, uh, maglalagay lang tayo ng space. Okay, malaking, medyo malaking space. So, you have 1. Then, we have 2. At saka 3. Okay? Next, we have 1. So, another digit naman po ito mga boss. So, naglagay lang tayo agad na ulit ng space. Okay, medyo malaking space. Okay? We have 1. Okay? So, these lines correspond to 131. So, we have 1, 3, tsaka 1. Okay? Next is 122. So, yung 1, dito tayo magsa-start sa uh, ilalim mga boss. Okay? Hindi tayo dito magsa-start. Okay? Tandaan na natin from left to right yung pagsulat ng mga digits or ng lines corresponding to the digits. So, first we have 1. So, sulat, uh, draw lang tayo ng Isang line dito mga boss. Okay. So, this is for 1. Okay. Next, we have 2. So, maglalagay lang tayo ng space. Okay. So, we have 1. We have 2. Okay. Again, we have last digit is 2. So, maglalagay ulit tayo ng space. Okay. Draw tayo ng 1. Then, 2. Okay. So, yung pink na lines mga boss corresponds to the digit, uh, to the number 122 at yung blue sa so 131. So, dito mga boss, bilangin natin kung ilang grupo. Okay. So, we have here, uh, eto, okay, naka-align yan, okay, isang grupo yan, eto, isang grupo din, okay, eto, isang grupo din, okay, kasi naka-align siya mga boss, eto, isang grupo at isa ding grupo. So, we have 5 digits na sagot mga boss. So, bilangin na natin mga boss kung ilan yung sagot. Okay, so first, from right to left yung pagbilang natin mga boss. Tandaan lang natin, from right, right to left. Yung pag-draw ng lines, from left to right. Okay? From left to right. Okay? But yung pagbilang ng intersection is from right to left. So, we have 1, 2. So, this is 2. Okay? Next, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, we have 8. Here, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay? Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here we have 1. So the answer is 15,982. Okay? Let us check mga boss if tama yung sagot natin. So 131 times 122 is 15,982. Tama mga boss. Okay? So, I hope may natutunan kayong uh, bagong lesson uh, regarding sa pag-multiply ng numbers gamit lamang yung mga lines. So, magdodraw lang tayo ng mga lines. Malalaman natin agad yung um, product ng dalawang numbers. So, again mga boss, salamat sa inyong panonood, Salamat sa pag-suporta sa ating channel. Thank you and God bless.